I would like to share with you the story of trying to make the Ugandan smallholder coffee farmer smile. A story of trying to empower a smallholder coffee farmer in Uganda. But before I do that, allow me to share with you a little bit of my personal story. I was born on a coffee farm, grew up on the coffee farm, school fees from coffee. But the experience I went through together with my parents, toiling, you know, day by day to get school fees for me, it was not easy. It was not at all easy. What, is, what was the problem? And up to date, what is the problem? The problem is that smallholder coffee farmers cannot fully grow and process their coffee. The smallholder coffee farmers are, are selling coffee to middlemen at less than 5% of the retail value. What this means is that smallholder coffee farmers lose their ownership to the middlemen before the coffee is ready, before coffee has value. Now this compounds the problem. You find that now over 10 million smallholder coffee farmers are in a vicious cycle of poverty. This is terrible for me. And immediately after my university, I had to join them and start mobilizing them. So as an organization in UCAFE, I created way back in 2003. We are there to improve the livelihoods of these smallholder Ugandan coffee farmers. What am I talking about here? And what differentiates us as New Cafe from the rest of those operating in the coffee industry? The farmer is uh, empowered to process the coffee. And for the little time we have had with the farmer, we have been able to enable the farmer process and add value to coffee and earn at least 30% more, you know, currently. Now, moving forward, we have been able to put in place a factory which we would like to operationalize. And the farmer continues to own the coffee. New Cafe is not a buy of coffee, not at all. Why? Because we want a farmer to sell a more valuable form of coffee which fetches more money. So the farmer is empowered to get through up to the top. By doing that, the income is increasing 10 times. And that is happening to me when I see changing uh, uh, in terms of incomes. And this happens because of the increased yield because of the ability to participate in the markets directly, the farmers themselves, and indeed the processing into value added uh, products. What are the actual services as a solution that we offer? You have to organize smallholder coffee farmers in cooperatives if you are to empower them. You have to enable them access affordable credit. You have to provide the necessary facilities, talk about the factory, end-to-end -end processing, not only to stop at the raw forms of coffee. And there you are empowering the farmers. And you have to uh, provide storage uh, capacity. You have to link them directly to the markets. As I've said, what differentiates us is that we don't buy coffee. What is our impact to date? Uh, we have been able to organize our farmers into 200,000 uh, 200, uh, families, into 188 uh, cooperatives, and we have seen an added increase of 30% in terms of income. Moving forward, we would like to have 220,000 farmers uh, organized in cooperatives. And as we move on, the end result is to have at least 900% increase in the income of our farmers. So our growth plan 
is to have the factory. We currently have a factory ready finished, but we want to secure the supply from the, the farmers, process that coffee, and by 2019, that's where our break even is. We'll be moving forward. So my ask is in two ways, line of credit and a, a grant. For the line of credit, for the past years, we have been borrowing at 25%. But now moving forward, we would like to be enabled to access money at least at less than 8%. This will help us to improve the farmer's cash flow and secure the coffee and move on. With a grant, we would like to set up a training center to ensure that we are able to train the cooperatives, to train the farmers, their capacity, expand the warehouse, and continuously carry on training. What I would like to promise you is that for every dollar you invest in new cafe, three times increase in yield of farmers will be attained, and 90 times income for the farming families. We want to invest in our children, because our children are our future. Thank you very much.